Beijing is full of incredible historic sites that everyone should visit on a trip to China. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide, and today we share the best things to do in Beijing, China. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. So the first thing you have to do while you're in Beijing is actually leave the city centre and visit the Great Wall of China. There are several spots around Beijing that offer different perspectives of the Great Wall. From the fully restored sections to the wild and challenging sections as well, choose one of these options and take a day trip out to see the wall. Just make sure to avoid the national holidays such as Golden Week which falls on the first week of October and Chinese New Year which tends to land around the end of January start of February. Next we have the Forbidden City. This palace complex is China's largest and best preserved collection of ancient buildings. Once home to two generations of dynasties, the Forbidden City is now a popular spot for tourists and Chinese alike. The entrance fee is 60 RMB and you can pay a guide to talk you through the palace or get an audio tour with prices starting at 40 RMB. Just remember that the Forbidden City is closed on Mondays but open every day otherwise from 8.30am. We recommend arriving here for opening time to avoid the tour buses or visit in the early afternoon around 2pm. Just make sure to bring your passport, wear comfortable shoes and wear layers if you are visiting outside of the summer. The Summer Palace is a beautiful place to explore, especially if you are visiting in the spring or summer months. This royal park is the gem of Beijing and a must visit whilst you are here. It is expansive and can take around two to three hours to walk around. Make sure to bring a camera and capture the rich landscapes and cultural heritage. Next we have Tiananmen Square, home to Chairman Mao's mausoleum, the National Museum of China and the Great Hall of People. There is a lot to see and do around this famous square. Historic for its bloody history and a focus point of the communist reign, the square cannot be missed. Just don't discuss its history in earshot of any officials. One of the most beautiful temples in China is the Temple of Heaven and it can be found here in Beijing. Divided by two encircling walls, this magnificently detailed building will take your breath away. This is an imperial complex that was once used by Chinese emperors to pray to their gods. After visiting all those historic sites, make sure to visit the hutongs. Now there are hutongs all over the city and these are old city lanes and courtyards, but nowadays they have been transformed to offer courtyard guest houses, markets, shops and boutique restaurants. We will leave some of our favourite hutongs below, you can't miss them because they really are all over Beijing. Looking to try some weird and wonderful street food, head to Dongguan Night Market. This runs from 4pm to 10pm, offering a variety of snacks that you can try. This bustling night market is the perfect place to start your Beijing experience. You can get all types of food here from meat skewers to strawberry kebabs, quail eggs to chicken hearts. Now this next one is one of my favourite things to do in the capital and we highly recommend it. Try the Peking Duck. Found in restaurants across the city, Peking Duck is a must watch you're in Beijing. You can find some amazing authentic restaurants that aren't too pricey and offer some of the best duck you will ever have. And lastly, a fairly new attraction to Beijing, Universal Studios Beijing. This brand new theme park opened at the end of 2021 and is a must visit for anyone who loves theme parks. Explore Jurassic Park, head to Minion Land and enjoy Kung Fu Panda before becoming a wizard in the world of Harry Potter. You could choose to go for a day trip or spend a night at the Universal Studios Grand Hotel. 
Watch this video to find out the things to know before you go to China. Then, to learn about how to travel China on a budget, watch this video. We hope you have an incredible time in Beijing and make sure to explore more cities in China. After living there for two years, we absolutely loved the country. Happy travels and stay creative.